Most can't imagine being homeless, so think how much harder. Most of us can't imagine being homeless, so think how much harder it might be living on the street when you're a child. There's a new shelter in Austin designed to give these children and the adults around them better lives. Molly Oak has the story. One, two, three. It's finished. And Corey Leaf with the Salvation Army says it's needed. Because there's such an urgent need to move families out of the downtown area in Austin because it's no longer child appropriate. And so the Rath Gaber Center is on the east side of town. It's away from all the commotion going on downtown. And this is just one way children can grow up in an environment, going to the school bus without having to worry, without parents having to worry about their children making it to the bus stop safely. The Salvation Army celebrated finishing phase one of the Rath Gaber Center for Families. When you have uh, children in the cycle of homelessness, you are affecting two generations right there. You have the adult and you have the children. So this shelter is very important because it's going to break and end the cycle of homelessness. The emergency shelter will have 120 beds and extra beds will be added when phase two of the shelter opens up in August. Along with a place to stay, Leith says they'll have some fun for the kids too. When you walk through these doors, we want to make sure that a child doesn't see their living surroundings as a shelter. We want them to see this as a transitional you know, time in their life. And so this is, we're trying to make this as much as home as possible while they're going through this crisis. And there will be case managers ready to help the families move forward. So this is probably the biggest thing that we provide here is because these case managers will be providing them opportunities for jobs, opportunities for affordable housing, just to get them back into self-sufficiency. A fresh start for the folks who need it most. In Austin, Molly Oak, KVU News. And that's a big operation. The shelter will cost more than $5 million to run each year. Families are expected to start moving in in August.